Hoy la cosa se puso buena El gozo corre por mi vena Vamos a olvidarnos de la pena Esta fiesta nadie la frena Time for baseball on the show from the bank Citizens Bank Park in Philadelphia Tonight it's the first of four Between the San Diego Padres and the Phillies It's baseball on the show and it's coming up next. Zach Wheeler gets the call for game one of the series. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, Matt, it's not easy to bunch anything together against this guy. In his last three starts, he has a whip of under 1.10. So we may see some hit and run. We may see some bunting. And we may see some running. Because if you want to lay around and try to get hits off this guy, that's not the right thing to do. One of the top pitchers in the game right now. So stepping in is Tommy Pham. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Fellas, you take a look at our home standing ball club as they come into this one tonight. They dropped another one last time out, and in fact, they've won just twice in their last eight tries. Yeah, Maddie, this team finds itself with a huge lead, double digits right now, and climbing, playing really good baseball. Some people will say, oh, you don't want to have that big a lead. You start resting on your laurels. I, I, I look at it the other way, man. You've earned the right to kind of get some guys off their feet if the manager wants to. There's a lot of different ways you can go about it. This team's focused and playing really good baseball. I would not worry about it. Keep pushing the throttle. The offensive game plan today is certainly to see the ball up. This guy is known on the mound for sinker changeup combination. He's going to try and establish down in the zone to get swing and a miss or ground balls consistently. You have to find something above the belt to get loose on. Eric Stepping up now, Eric Hosmer, and he's a guy that's really scuffling at the plate right now. First pitch on the way. Hey. The wind up and the 0 1. Oh, and he looks like he's toying with him here. It's 0 and 2. And that's into the corner of foul ball and right. Bases are empty, one man out. And on 0 and 2, he misses with a fastball. Able to protect the plate with two strikes, and he'll see another one. To two balls and two strikes now. You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first inning can reveal a lot. The 2 2. Freezes three. him on the inside, strike three. One thing to know is not all strikeouts are created equal. Right there, he goes down on strikes, but he really made that guy on the mound work for it. And when you're doing that in the first inning, it can have an effect on how deep he's going to be able to go into this start. There's a big difference between that and going down on three or four pitches. Up next is Fernando Tatis Jr. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. And he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Center fielder going back. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. 
three up, three down for San Diego. We'll go to the bottom of the first. No score. Denelson Lamette gets the start for San Diego in this one. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, if a slider is your thing, you found your guy here in Denelson Lamette. Might have the best slider from the right side in all of baseball. It's a hard breaking ball, it breaks across and down. By the way, he throws 95 to 96 miles an hour to go along with it. If he has both the hard slider and that good fastball, they're going to have a difficult time scoring any runs off this guy. And now the first pitch as he'll cut on and miss it a good slider at the knees for strike one guys the swing and friars as they take the field here tonight have got to be considered one of if not the hottest team in baseball right now winners of eight of their last ten ball games. Yeah Maddie Dan this team is playing well they're getting closer in the division race I, I guess my question to you I, I want to ask you did you find that you started to really pitch better as the summer months started to get hotter no doubt about it not only does this team start feeling better but I think you get a good vibe starts to go throughout the clubhouse you realize that the, the schedule is trying starting to wind itself down every game is more important the bigger the game hopefully the better you play and this team's been playing some really good baseball lately having a little trouble finding the zone to start the night it's always deflating to walk the leadoff guy in the game so we'll see if he can initiate some contact here the three one he is swung on and missed a full count now got a pitch to the ballparks dimensions right here love the execution of that pitch down in the zone got to keep the ball in the yard and a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning really good late bite on that slider right there the best ones have that late action that just darts at the last minute they're so tough to get the bat on and when you've got that good slider going it's a great strikeout pitch into the box Joaquin Dias. And he's a bit tardy there on the first pitch fastball. It's nothing in one. He'll let her play here with that average down in the low 200s. Nine homers and an even 20 RBIs. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. O'Grady is there now, and he has it, two gone. Batting third. Third baseman, Javier Baez. Next, here is Javier Baez. No one aboard for him, and two gone here in the first. Now here it comes. Swing and a miss. Blew it right by him at 96. It's a ball and a strike. If the offense didn't already know, man on the mound's got his A-game fastball working today. The one-two is taken for a ball as that slider broke off the plate. Two out, nobody on. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. The throw is wild and it gets away. It's always nice to get something cooking in the first inning, even with two outs. Now your cleanup man steps to the plate and has a chance to drive in the first run of the game. Here's Bryce Harper now as he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball 0 and 1 in his career against this pitcher he's two for three he also has one home run the 0 1 offering just got the corner that time with a fastball strike two on 0 2 here he doesn't have to give in with a great pitch to hit he's got a base open so he has to focus on making a good pitch right here. Here's the one two and here's a pitch inside and that got him 
This is a perfect example of why the slider is such a great pitch and such a dangerous pitch, too. Sometimes it moves so much that you just lose control of it. This one runs way too far in, and the hitter is standing on first as a result. Giancarlo Stanton now as he lays off a fastball too low for ball one. Love the fact that he's not scared to go right back inside with another fastball. I know he hit the last guy, but if he's going to have success, he's got to establish that pitch in. Oh, this one bounces off the pitcher. Throw to first, but he's safe. And now the stadium's attention turns back to the man on the mound. Dan, after that base hit right there, he's got a six-game hit streak going. You know what? And this could be this could lead him on to something, some bigger and better things right here. He's been swinging the bat pretty well, and he's been rewarded for it, as you talked about. Six-game hitting streak so far. One ball, no strikes to count. The 1 0. And this winds up inside for a ball. 2 0 now. Nowhere to put anybody. 2 0 count. Not a good spot to be in as a pitcher. And he fouls this one off. The 2 1 pitch. Hey, it often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. Now, a ball lined hard toward deep right field. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. One run scores. If we look at the initial angle and the first step quickness, he was off just a bit and it cost him. That ball's a double because he didn't get off the box quick enough. That brings up Alec Bohm. As he'll take a look at a slider here that misses for ball one. I think this inning could have far reaching effects in this game. They're really making him work and unless he dials it in it's probably going to limit how deep he goes into this game. The 1 0 unable to find the zone with the slider. Well I think he's got to find a way out of this jam and limit the damage. If he's unable to do that this game could get away from him. Runners at second and third with two gone. Down low and the plot thickens here. Three and oh. This inning hasn't gone the way he wanted it to but it's not a total disaster yet. Sometimes pitching is about damage control so if he can strand these guys out there that would be pretty huge. A strike and it's three and one. Hey, I still believe in my heart the best pitch is a well-executed fastball down the way, and that's exactly what that is. He swings at that. That's off the end of the bat. That's not hard contact at all, and that's an easy out for the defense. Payoff hey, pitch on its way, and this is swung on and missed as the 30th pitch of this inning finally does the trick. The side is retired. So it's two runs on three hits, no errors. And two men left stranded. We move to inning number two here in Philadelphia. Philadelphia is on top, two to nothing. Here's Manny Machado now. And as you check out his righty lefty splits, no surprise that he hits better against southpaws than he does against right handers. You know, these next couple innings are really important for these guys. I know they're only down by a couple, but they need to get something going on offense to keep pace, even though it's early. He swings and grounds it to short. Scooped up. Throw is in time for the first out of the second. Yeah. 
So the next to bat will be Austin Nova and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. And a high strike to begin the at bat. It's 0 and 1. Look at the radar gun on that slider. Off speed pitch 91 miles an hour. That's just pure filth. Here comes the 0 1. Rolled slowly down the third baseline. But this will be a foul ball as he's behind 0 and 2 now. Boy, so far early into this one, this guy's pitching really well. And I'm a big believer in body language. He's getting the ball. He's working really quick, keeping the ball down in the zone. And if you take a look at this guy so far early on, a lot of positive signs. He looks like he brought his good stuff in this one. And that's the second out. Oh, that'll make that you smile good. as a pitcher. You make a good pitch. You, you blow the guy's oh, yeah. bat up, and then oh, you great. make the play yourself. In your head, you're thinking, nice swing, meat. Into the box now, Brian O'Grady. And on the first pitch, he grounds foul. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Fouled off. Bases are empty here with two men out. A little bit off the outside. It's one and two. Tried to backdoor him and lock him up with a curveball right there. Pretty good pitch, but he didn't quite get it to come back all the way to the corner. That's tough to do for most guys. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And a base hit, the first one of the game for the Padres. Boy, just when you're looking for one of those shutdown innings, you get two Got quick outs, D roll, then the you have a, a two out base hit to extend the inning. Yeah, you show me a, a big league ball player that's going to give away an AB, no chance. Everybody's in there grinding every at bat, every plate appearance. Nice job, maybe a little two out lightning start. One ball, no strikes to count. A runner on first with two away. And he popped him up. Stanton coming on. He's not going to have a play on it. And this might bring home the runner from first. Hey, they're not all beautiful. And they don't all have to be. Just throwing a lawn dart over the third baseman's head right there. Beautiful piece of hit. So here's Will Myers. As the first pitch here is a bit high, it's ball one. Looking to make it three straight two out hits here. He's got a runner in scoring position at second. A ball and a strike. Smoke toward the hole. And that is into right field, a base hit. The throw to the plate. And he will get in there with their first run. It's a two to one game now. Boy, that's an aggressive send there, Dero, because this outfielder has a very strong throwing arm. Yeah, when you're sitting in a hitter's meeting, that's stuff they go over. So every base runner is on notice, knowing that this guy's got one of the strongest arms in the league, but they challenged him, and it worked. At the plate, Denelson Lamette. And he puts it on the ground to second. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. So it's a run on three hits, no errors, and two men left on. Now to bat, Daryl Cooley. Ready. Here's the first pitch. As he'll get a slider up that time, but he swings through it for the first strike. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one.
high in the air and drifting out to shallow center. O'Grady comes on now and he has it one down. Batting nut, the pitcher, Zach Wheeler. Now with the plate is Zach Wheeler. First pitch of the A.B. now. And he throws the fastball by him here, 0-1. Hey, when you're featuring a mid-90s fastball like this pitcher, attack with that pitch. Get ahead. Get the offense on their toes. That opens up the off-speed pitches later in the game. One out, nobody on. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. The next 0-2. Rolled slowly down the first baseline. And there's out number two. Now back. And that'll Second bring up Keston Huron. First pitch of the AB on its way. Fouled away. The wind up and the 0 1. Two out, nobody on. And it's fouled away. Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely late on that pitch after seeing a previous off speed pitch. Yanked the slider across that time, laid off for a ball. And he fouls this one off. Another try at 2 2. Four foul balls in this AB. Pitcher cannot find anywhere to go to put this guy away. Strike three called as he can't get the bat off his shoulders. Side retired. Now to the play, Tommy Pham, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Wheeler gets the sign, first pitch on the way. up and the 0-2 pitch. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. Line drive base hit to right. Hey guys I like the execution by the batter there. He got a hanger in the middle of the plate. He could have come unglued but he didn't. He stayed focused and drove a line drive base hit. First baseman Eric Hosmer is in as he'll take a look at a sinker here too low for ball one. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Here comes the 1 0. Non competitive pitch right there runs the count to 2 0 and he is ready to do some damage in the box. From the stretch, Fams off and running. Pitches a cold strike. The throw, not in time. He's in there at second. Strike swinging, timing a little off on that one. So far in this game, he's the only guy in the lineup that's gone down on strikes. This is the only guy in the lineup that struck out so far, and now he finds himself in the hole with two strikes. High in the air out towards shallow right. 
And that's taken in straightaway right. Will he try from second? Striding in is Fernando Tatis Jr. Trying here to plate the tying run from second. And now the first pitch. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. Line drive to left. Stanton is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. Well, he hit that ball pretty well, but the only problem was that he pulled off it just a bit. The location was a little on the outer half, so he would have hit it even better if he would have stayed through the middle of the field with it. And in steps Manny Machado as he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. The 0 1 offering. Hey, textbook waste pitch right there. Does he go elevated fastball again or something slow below the zone. Neither guy willing to give in and the ad battle continue the one two pitch and he comes back with a fastball strike three called and the inning is over one left for San Diego our score remains two to one. Bottom of the inning now, and at the plate will be the speedy outfielder, Joaquin Dias. First pitch coming, here it is. As he'll take a look at ball one. Fouled off. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. A good pitch, but if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. Boy, he just threw that fastball by him. Get it ready, big boy. This guy's throwing three digits right here. The best way I can help the fans is 90 to 92 you can usually see seams 92 to 95 it starts to really quicken up on you over three digits you're seeing a white blur full count now Here's a slider strike three called and that'll be the first out of the inning. Yeah as they say there's a hole in his swing in that location. So a good job two. there of exploiting that. That can be real hard for some guys to overcome when teams start figuring out what locations you just can't handle. And that brings up Javi Baez. Behind on that one now behind in the count 0 and 1. One for one as he reached base with a double his first time up. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Oh, this is what you get fired up for right here. Hard fastball against a power hitter. I know he was late right there, but if he comes back, this one might not come back. Got him to miss the breaking ball there. Javier Baez becomes out number two this inning. And Bryce Harper will dig in at the plate. Harper swings and sends a ball well hit out to right. And gone. An absolute bomb. Solo home run off the bat of Bryce Harper. Number 31 for him on the season. As they extend the lead a bit, it's now 3-1. to one. No surprise with that swing of the bat. This guy is simply one of the best in the game right now. There's not too many guys that take a beautiful hack like that in the league.
digging into the batter's box. Next will be Giancarlo Stanton. As he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. Bases are empty here with two men out. And he misses with it one and one. Fouled away. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's located. Uh, we'll have to press pause. Is that strike?